Hello friend, welcome back. In our previous video, I have discussed about that logical operators. I hope you understand that part very clearly. Now in this video, I want to discuss about that equality operator. I have already discussed about that things with you. That will be the equality, okay, equality operator. So into this equality operator, it's very easy. Mm, like I want to do and to make it as a clean right now. That is, I take one of the variable as a price and here I pass one of the value as a 10, which is totally fine. So now I want to do and to put this one of the condition. Here, I don't want to remove everything. So there is a price and price will be equal. That will be the three equal and three equal or I make it as a 10. Now that should be display which boolean that should be display as a true because our this condition is true, right? That is our price is 10. So price when it will be equal equal a 10. So now that should be displayed as a true. Click as a save all and now refresh it. You can see it's now displayed as a true. Great. And also the same that is another operator as I told you before that is a not, right? So that is a not if you want to use it as a not. I make it as a not and then equal not equal I make it as a 220 okay now if you click as a save all now if you click as a refresh now you can see it's not also display as a true that means that is our not or equal as a our this 10 for this you see it's not display as a true all right if you want to make it as a um, 10 if you want to make it as a 10 click as a save all now that should be display as a false click as a refresh you can see it's not display as a false Great, but here also one thing a lot of students uh, can become confused it. Uh, I show you what exactly that things like here I copy it and then I paste it. So if you use that as a two um, equal like here I use it as a two equal and I use it as a one. Okay, I use the same things. But right now if you click as a save all our condition will be same. That means our result will be same if you click as a refresh. You can see it's not displayed as a true, false, true, and then false. That means our result is the same. If you want to make it as a 20 and also want to make this 20, that means that should be now as a true. If you click as a save all, refresh, and you can see every result is the same. So why you should use some of the time as a three equal? Why you should use some of the time as a two equal? I show you that is the main major difference between both of these. When you use it as a three equal, that means it's equal or not, right? When you use that as a three equal, it will be checked both of this data type. Like that is a one of the data type as a number data type. And you can see that is also our another type. So that is our number data type, right? It will be checked both of these. But here, when you use that as a double is equal to, then that will be not this get any data type. Whatever the data type it is doesn't matter if you want to make it as a right now I want to do and to make it as a string value. Okay, so that is the not number type. That is the string type, right? Into this string type, if you click as a save all, now if you go, it, it, our result will be same. You can see our result is the same as a true. But here when you use that as a triple equal, then that will be actually match. That should be as a number type. Here, if you put a cause, you can see that is our number type. As before, I have already discussed about that things with you. With the type of, you can check it, right? So, if that is our number type. And if you now make it as a string value, like right now, that is one of the string value, right? It should be not get this data properly. If you click as a save all, now that should be displayed as a false. Click as a refresh, you can see it's not displayed as a false. So, I hope you get some of the idea. What is different between both of these? So here, when you use as a three equal, or both of these type should be same. But here, when you use as a double equal, then our uh, data type is doesn't matter. Okay, here that will be the same. Here, if you want to pass that number, you can pass that number. If you want to pass the string value, only it should be checked with the value. So that is the major difference between both of these. Rather than everything will be just like that same. Okay, friend. I hope it is very much clear to you. So thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.